News has been circulating around Armenian media that the European Parliament has adopted multiple resolutions calling for an increase in the EU monitoring mission in Armenia, with an additional mission on the border with Turkey Air, for introducing, to its own detriment, sanctions against Bakur, for freezing new agreements and suspending negotiations with them. No matter how ridiculous it may sound, European parliamentarians, either due to lack of education or suffering from sclerosis or dementia, call on the Azerbaijani authorities, who have repeatedly stated all of the following, to allow the safe return of the Armenian population to Karabakh and provide firm guarantees for the protection of their rights. Well, the last chord in this cacophony of political illiteracy, undoubtedly the influence of the Armenian lobby, was a call for Azerbaijan to allow the presence of an EU monitoring mission on its side of the border. In Karabakh, political scientist Rasim Mosabikov shared his opinion on this topic with Baku TV Ru. Unfortunately, this is not the first case of an irresponsible, unilateral pro-Armenian statement adopted by members of the European Parliament. They have elections coming soon. And these people are largely focused on gaining the votes of the wealthy Armenian diaspora, which are widely represented in countries such as France, Belgium and the Netherlands, with a focus on these voters and their support. Members of the European Parliament from different parties have made similar statements. Fortunately, their statements are worthless. These statements are of no consequence and Azerbaijan can simply ignore them. We have already practically stopped all relations with the European Parliament. Statements of this kind won't make a difference, so they can say whatever they want, as these statements have no impact on our politics. That's all I can say. There is hope that after the elections to the European Parliament in the summer, the number of such irresponsible members of the European Parliament will at least somewhat decrease.